Go, hurry up! Dude, this music is so good. Oh, you ready for that drop? So good. Whoa! We dropped in. Where are we? Where are we? We're uh, nerd root hunting. Wow, the most interesting thing to start off on, huh? <coughs> Dude, I woke up with a study nose. I better not be getting sick again. I was just sick like three weeks ago, or a month ago. It was horrible. It was literally so bad I couldn't stream one day. Also, yes, we are a poser. We started wearing good armor because I really want to use destruction until I have paralyze. And I really like destruction because it's very strong. Very, 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 very strong. Uh, and I want to use destruction, so to not have to cast shield and heal as often, I'm wearing the actual armor you're supposed to at the cave. Instead of sticking to, like, leather. Uh, and we have four to five Magicka pants. So it, it actually kind of looks like a fit, not gonna lie. The boots kind of throw it off, but we don't have any better shoes. And then we've got the fucking, the elven longsword. Because of the fact that I'm avoiding using blade in combat because I'm leveling destruction, I haven't been leveling up as quickly. So I've actually been able to find a gear at my level instead of going to level 18 and just finding glass all of a sudden. It's been fun. I will say, using the bound weapons early on kind of made me reconsider my stance on daggers. I might actually carry around Mayrune's Razor uh, from now on in runs where I use Blade. <gasps> Oof. It's not a problem for us because we have fucking. We have fucking. Yeah, baby. Look at us. Look at us. Oh shit, I need to turn the music down like a little bit. I don't want it to get copyrighted. But, on my off time, I turn it up because you really fucking have trouble hearing it. And it's fucking annoying. The only time you hear it is when you hear the battle music start. Let me make sure I didn't miss any of on this way. Dude, this is so fucking sick. It's like unnecessary, because the swimming would have done the same thing. If anything, I could have swam below the water for athletics experience, but it's just so fucking cool. You dead? Yeah, I killed him. Alright, so uh, on the map, where are we going? Forlorn Watchman buying a house. Darcy's Air Balloon. Okay, so we're on our way. Looks like we're on our way down south to Leyland. Okay. Uh, then let's take this road. By a new twill. Oh, and we'll check this little corner of the map this week.
can't see any up there. Maybe it's behind this rock. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I wonder if I've sneezed enough on this channel for any of my sneezes to wind up in that sneeze porn archive. Someone wants to smoke. Where are you? Oh, is it a fucking mud crab? F. But we lost our super cool sea stride. Actually, we need to... So we're running a little faster. Doing this at night time is probably a bad idea, not gonna lie. I wish the Nerd Nerd actually fucking glowed in this one. That was a really good addition on Skyrim's part, even though there's no, re no reason to get uh, Nerd Nerd. Other than that one girl. <coughs> who, uh... Uses it for poisons. She's like evil. What's her name? It was a Blackbriar. I don't remember her name though, like her first name. We're on the road to Saffron City. I can't go that way, why is there a mud crab over there? It's bullshit. Well, yeah, I complain about a lot, but that is a little bullshit. Come on. Get your ass over here. We'll settle this like men. Enemy is nearby. Ugh. Come on. Oh, it's the deer. Okay. Just give it a little bit for the deer to run away. Dude, if you're not gonna run away, I'm gonna have to kill you. Okay, fine. Literally asking for it. Oh, shit, now it's a bear. Like two nerd root. I think that was worth it. A new twill. Sorry, I had to check a text. Check a text? No, it is check a text. Take a checks would be wrong, but check a text sounds wrong. Okay, so we checked that a little bit. And along this way, we made it to. We made it to Fort Irony. Circled around the riverbank. That's why we were up here. Okay, so. Going to Bond. Eh, going to Fort Irony and heading west to the road. Sounds like the best way. Either that or we could circle along the coastline. Until we make it to uh, Leyland. That sounds smart too. Oh, oof! I kind of want a mod that just changes your fall damage sound to Mario's. Oof! It's just super obnoxious and invasive. That was a really bad oof. There's like a there's like a high pitch and a fear to it that I can't really do. Oh shit, that's right, we need to be moving fast. 
because once you get the light and load, it actually makes like an X1 pack on your speed. Is this way? Wait, I don't need that anymore. We have the skeleton key. I don't need that anymore because I have the skeleton key. That means I can put something on there. Should I put it on there? Let's see, where do I got guard? Maybe it should be a charm spell. No, we'll do forty five speed. What is it? Candlelight? Candlelight's forty. Moonlight is thirty. This feels like in... Oh, there it is. I see it. It always... Whenever you can't tell where an enemy is coming from, it feels like that fucking season in Baki where they're all just trying to attack each other whenever they're, like, anywhere for no reason. Where they literally just bust out of prison because they want to start beating each other's asses and they just want smoke. It, it feels like that whenever you can't tell where an enemy is. It feels like someone is just coming out of nowhere for you for no reason. Oh, I can't actually hurt you with this. Ooh, yeah, I'll be able to beat this. I, I can't. I don't think I'm strong enough. Just barely. We have to avoid Will of the Wisp for now on, I guess. Will of the Wisps are ahead of the level curve when you find them. They're just so strong. I think that experience of getting beat by one so bad it crashed my game. <laughs> First time we played through as the Dark Elf Lady was really great. I don't want Date Rapist Ron on Nerd Root. Where? Where is it? 
and what's beef. Oh shit, uh, we should do four. So it'll move a little faster. This is distinctive. I'll remember this when I come back. By the way, I've been using Heal Minor Wounds instead of Heal Major Wounds, and uh, Restoration is still only barely catching up. Fort no more. me when I cease to exist. <gasps> I like how the chainmail looks in this game, but I don't think it was for the reason they intended. You look all like monstrous and meshy. Uh, you're a meshy. You look like all weird and gooey. I can't imagine what they were going for, but it looks really cool. I love the atmosphere of like the rainy marsh area of the game. I really struggle playing this game uh, without background noise because I've like I've got like uh, brain rot and I need to have something grabbing my attention at all times. But this game is just pretty. Ooh. Uh, we used up all our potions, didn't we? Hmm. Okay. I ain't afraid of you. I really struggle with the, like, the, the playing this game without background noise because it's a little barren. Which, like, I'm not going to entirely blame myself for. This game is pretty barren most of the time. But, the marsh area is, like, completely censored. Uh, what would be the word? Like, if all of your senses is captivating. I think, like, the marsh area is... And like the 
Hammerfell Grass Plains. I believe it's a uh, Colovia. Is what that area is called. I feel like such a bitch. I have to like avoid the whisk because it's gonna murder me. I'm gonna keep that in case I have to run into a world of wisp. Where are we? That's right, it's this little unmarked thing where it goes over to that side. We'll discover this for it, but I think we're gonna adventure on this side. We'll come back to the side later. Just so we don't do as much uh, nerd dirt hunting all at once. You gotta pace it. I'm also pretty certain this is the one with the coffin with the dark feather head. I'm starting to get that game knowledge just like imbued into my mind. Is this Fisherman's Rock? As a journeyman of illusion, you know what is and isn't real. That's me. I'm the realist. Alright. Um, hmm. Oh, that would be on touch. Duh. Stupid. Debilitate. Where is Shadow Shade? Four. Star Alex Four. Scamp. Okay, we're good. What can I do for you? I heard that some cult called the Mythic Dawn is behind the Emperor's assassination. Go ahead, please. Oh! Dude, like a million, million episodes ago. When you go to that place with the girl who asked you to kill the grave robber, there's just a bunch of people in her inn for no reason. I remember I was like, why the hell are so many people here? They've got to be tied to a quest. That group that ambushes you when you do uh, Secrets of the High Fane or whatever. Cleansing of the High Fane. That's where they stay before they come to like rob you. And I'm sure that's not new knowledge to a lot of people, but that was crazy to me. They don't just spawn in out of nowhere when you do that quest.
Dude, Oblivion runs way too easily at max settings because it's like an old, ugly game. It's gonna be sad going back to games that are like look, going to any game that looks remotely decent and having to play it at like 360p. Although to be fair, I don't play any games that look good. <laughs> I've fought mud crabs more fearsome than you. stuff. Water's Edge. This is where you get high on drugs and murder a bunch of people. not sound yummy. The only milk I like is strawberry milk. Ah! Dude, I'm telling you, when you get that heartburn, because all your diet consists of is like RC Cola and Mean Bean, and you're gonna get that, you're gonna get that heartburn, nothing tastes better than a fucking, I think it's Yo Plate, strawberry milk. That shit hits the spot. We got a pretty good sized number of Mirren Reed, though. The White Stallion Lodge. Ooh! Is that a Heavenstone? Shazar stone. What enemies are nearby? We can come back in three hours, and if it's not, then we'll just upload the same voice. Has that guy showed up yet? I still haven't gotten Auden's videos to show up when I wait anywhere. It's taking longer this run. Ah, fuck off. Actually, have we hit 50? We have not hit 50 renown yet. I've been going and getting all my uh, heaven stones as I get the renown instead of waiting until I find them. Uh, but so far, they're not really worth it. They're all pretty bad. I really like the idea of the. Ah! 
heaven stones. They're just all, they all suck. Excuse me, I'm on duty. The Emperor is dead, and so are his heirs. We're a legion without a leader. The blades were trusted with our Lord's protection. Dude, I have to know what happens between this Legion officer and this Will of the Wisp. Ah, oh, you bitch. You pussy. He's not messing with it either. Come on, get him. I'll help you out, buddy. Do I have anything to boost magic out from greater powers? My man's had the meat on him. Full homo. Go that way. Yeah, he won't move.
That mud crab came from fucking oblivion to terrorize the mortal realm. Sorry about that, taking a text. Uh. <gasps> Hell yeah, it's only one time. Favorite scene of the game. I can't sell you any horse flesh. You have to go inside and talk to Catface. Have you been near Rosentia Galenus' house recently? Smells horrible. Like she left some meat out to spoil. Every time I pass by that woman's house, I hear odd animal noises and the smell of foul. Maybe she's caring for some sick pet or something. Whatever it is. She should clean up her act. It's surprising that a wealthy woman like that would let her property fall into such disarray. Good. What is it now? Welcome to the Five Rider Stables. I have many fine horses for sale. Uh, okay, so only one, but it is a fine paint horse. Bogak Grobo has some good books at Southern Books. He's an odd one, though. Always seems ready for a fight. Be seeing you. Rude snitch. Well met. Mm -hmm. Perhaps you'll be able to assist me. I'm after some scuba dealers. A small group of scuba dealers, led by a dunmer named Kylie Sonarbo, is holed up in the Grayland settlement, just up the road. I've been trying to catch Lenarbo for months, but every time I approach the place, the lookout sees me, and he goes running. I need someone to go in there and put a stop to those fetchers. I don't care what it takes. We must get that poison they're selling off the street. Bring me Lenarbo's ring as proof he's been dealt with. Don't turn your back on the novel for a second. You wouldn't think twice about burying his blade there. Hell yeah. I guess we need to work on Conjuration next so that we can cast uh, Stronger Astronauts. 
Sometimes there are uh, nerd root along the walls of water cities like Reville and Lillian, so I was checking. How strong is the danger dragger, da dragger dagger now? Yeah, it's weaker than this. Hit him with the vine boom sound effect. Never gets old. Fucking drug den. You can just walk in. One second, thanks. I keep forgetting that there's a, uh, a take all button. I actually discovered that recently because I was watching someone and they took all and I was like, how the fuck did they take all? And then there's a take all button in the corner. I played through a hundred episodes on this fucking, on the VOD channel and I never fucking realized you hit take all. I mean, what, it doesn't have a significant impact. It's not just code. Is that all? That's all. God, restoration just does not keep up. That's pitiful. What are we doing now? Conjuration. It would be faster if this one was faster over the watch. So what's the news from Draymond? Any 
luck taking down the Navo. You've done it! I can't even begin to thank you enough. By the divines, I salute you in the name of the Legion. Here is your well-earned reward. Alrighty. I gotta stop for there. But this was a nice little chunk of the game. Bye.